Hey everybody, I'm gonna do a review on a new episode of Hibiki Euphonium, and otherwise you could call it Sound Euphonium, which is episode 4. Um, this episode right here, it seems to be pressuring for the other cases for our band members, so if anything else, let's go. Okay, at the beginning of the episode, I believe like um, there were a couple of dramatic moments here and there, but when it got to a point where the um, teacher or I don't know who it is, but after the teacher had a little talk with all of them, like, um, you guys saying that you're all not going to play in the Sun Festival if you guys don't get, get this straight in a week. So he decides to get them all to, into a certain exercise, and dang, it's going to be like, <clears throat> it was pretty tough for all of them. And he all told them, y'all want to go for national, so that's why I'm, so that's why I'm like pushing your, pushing your limits right now to, to this point. And, you know, like, they all couldn't really take it really greatly. They were pretty upset about this. Except for our, um, one of our main heroines, Kosaka. She pretty much has no problem with this. She goes like, ah, uh, it's no issue, you know, that kind of thing. But, as time goes on, we have a little moment about, like, Kumiko Omurai, along with this other, along with this other dude, which I've forgotten. Oh, I think it's Sumakoto, um... Shuichi, they end up having a little talk about what the teacher has been doing, but Kosaka was on her way home with her bike, and she tells him, like, y'all better stop complaining and stop be talking smack behind his back, right? It's pretty, it's pretty pathetic. And by the time, by the time she was on the lead, he go, the boys are like, dude, I wasn't even talking smack behind his back, because she says, what did you say? She, he goes, like, nothing, nothing, nothing. <laughs> And as usual, nothing much is really going on, just band practice here and there. And when Kumiko is about to get her instrument, Kosaka wants to talk to, wants to have a little talk with her, and she was kind of a little nervous about this, but she, but Kosaka just came to apologize because she said too much yesterday. But Kumiko tells her, I'm the one that should, shouldn't be talking as much, you know, I should just keep practicing, blah, blah, blah. And she did tell Kosaka, like, um, your instruments and what you did was pretty amazing, you know, awe-inspiring. Awe and then she just runs off really quickly. <laughs> I'm going, ah, girls these days, that's what I was thinking. And, yeah. After a couple days or many or possibly one week, after practicing here and there, everyone doing the exercises that the teacher gave them, <laughs> He finally got to see what the kind they are capable of, and after a couple of things here and there, one of the girls says like, "If he's not gonna let us play in the Sun Festival, I'm gonna throw my mouthpiece at him." I'm just thinking, my mind, girl, calm down, okay, etc. And so far, we see to it that our that our band plays the instrument and emphasis or whatever it is called, um, whatsoever. They manage to. Get through, which is a good thing. He says, "Congratulations, you uh, guys can play in the Sun Festival that y'all been waiting for." He did give them a schedule, and it looks like they're gonna be playing on the weekends too. Which is right now, like him, he told him, he told him it should not be much of a problem. You guys wanna get to nationals, right? So let's go. <clears throat> and the next piece begins, etc. So far, this episode seems to be pretty, pretty okay or good. You know, I mean, some progression here and there, and development for certain characters where. Kumiko encourages her senpai to try to like play together and yeah, etc. Nothing much going on. Anyways, I think that's about it. Um, expect my next review to maybe come up very very late for tonight because I'm pretty sure there's another another series I have to watch, but it's gonna come up very late due to the fact that I have something else to do for the day and tomorrow is kind of like um tough and rough for me. So I'll see y'all till then. I'm off of Zero. Have a good day and I'll see you guys next time. All right, peace out. Bye bye.